I would like to congratulate and thank World Economic Forum for holding the WEF East Asia Summit in Indonesia for the first time, which solely demonstrates the attention and growing importance of Indonesia in the region as well as in the global arena. Pertamina is proud to be one of the foundation members of this forum and will continue its commitment to support this organization, especially in order to find a solution on how to improve the collaboration and cooperation in energy sector amongst countries in the region in responding to the new globalization. The theme for this year's WEF on East Asia is responding to the new globalization. For us, the new globalization calls for more collaboration and cooperation to tackle global and regional challenges and at the same time maximize opportunities. As the largest economy in Southeast Asia, Indonesia has a strategic role to facilitate and encourage collaboration and cooperation in the East Asia in various areas to create a more dynamic, responsive, responsible, and sustainable region. This forum is a great opportunity for us to encourage business and political leaders to collaborate and cooperate in East Asia, facing today's global reality and future challenges. This forum is also very relevant to East Asia countries, including Indonesia, because despite economic momentum and progress in the past few years, the region still faces from uneven economic development, increased frequency and magnitude of natural disasters, and balance between pursuit of economic growth and creation of sustainable and future-looking economic agenda. We are fully aware that energy sustainability will be one of the most pressing issues in this forum. Asia is often highlighted as a growing consumer of energy, as well as the region's significant hydrocarbon resources base, i.e. oil and gas. However, the higher its supply leads Asian countries to looking into new energy sources and innovations. At Pertamina, we aim to focus on supplying geothermal as an alternative energy for electricity power plant. For this, we will continue developing our geothermal reserves, as currently the installed capacity is only around 4% of the geothermal potential. We also committed to develop our CBM resources. We aspire to become a market leader in Indonesia, to build a world-class capability in this area, and to achieve global recognition and reputation. In making all of this happen, we believe that collaboration and cooperation are urgently needed to be implemented to anticipate high economic and social costs of developing these energy resources in the future. We admitted that Asian countries have made some progress in bilateral and multilateral dialogues to promote collaboration and cooperation, especially in the energy field. Unfortunately, they are still far from establishing a regional architecture of energy security. Therefore, a realistic implementation, not just study and propaganda, on calling collaboration and cooperation amongst regional governments and policymakers between public and private sectors and within the private sector in the region is urgently needed. I hope all of you could enjoy this World Economic Forum on East Asia Summit in Jakarta, Indonesia and gain abundance of benefits from this summit, especially by forming the framework of collaboration and cooperation in all aspects, including the energy sector, to secure common benefits in order to maintain a rapid economic growth and development in the region.